Hey, -o. this is my inscription card generator and I want to show what it does. In my opinion, the coolest feature is that you can export a card straight into the game with the help of a mod. I'll talk more about that later. Let me show you what you can do first. I originally made this to be an easy way to make your own cards that you could print for yourself. In my opinion, it does this pretty well. You can modify almost all stats of the card, whether that be the name, type of card, health, power or power ability, cost, sigils, portraits and a bunch more attributes. This generates a high quality image that when printed at 300 dpi becomes 2.25 times 3.5 inches big, which is the same size as the bridge cards that the inscription card seems to be based off. Because I intended these cards to be for printing, I added a feature to add an extra border to the cards so cutting them out would become easier. Now I want to put some focus on the style here. It's currently set to Act 1 style, but we can change that to the style of Act 2. And without changing anything else with our card, we can generate it in Act 2 style. You can even add scan lines if that's your thing. You might have noticed the last style option, Pixel Profile Gate. Pixel redrew almost all creatures in his own style. We collaborated and I put all his assets into the generator. Thanks Pixel! I just want to briefly mention the other part of the generator. The same principles apply as before, but you can generate the backsides and all the special types of cars as well. If you think you'll get good use out of my generator, please leave a like on the video, it helps both mentally and algorithmically. Link to the generator in the description. Before you run off and use the generator, depending on how many people are using the generator at the same time, it might be very slow or straight out the break. Last time I mentioned the generator in a community post, the server spiked to max capacity and then it broke. I've since upgraded the server, and if you want to help me pay for hosting, I have a Patreon. Besides keeping the generator alive, you also get your name in the list of supporters visible on the generator itself. Thanks! Now. I'll do a basic overview of what needs to be done in order to import your cards into the game. Sometime later I'll do a slower step-by-step -step tutorial showing all this in detail. The mod needed is the JSON loader by Mad95 and I use R2ModMan to install the mod. Go to the settings and open the profile folder, then the plugins folder. To keep things tidy I have a folder for all my custom cards. In the generator export the card and put the folder with the random name inside our cards folder. Voila! We now find our card in the game. And there you have it. If you're interested in updates to the generator, subscribe or follow me on Twitter where I post the majority of the updates to the generator. Bye!